Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the Astro AI brand, their 12 volt car refrigerator with an actual compressor. This is not PGO or semiconductor. This actually has a very efficient working compressor, just like your main fridge and freezer does in your home. I wanted to show how the Astro AI 12 volt car refrigerator with a compressor was mailed. You can look right here. It was in a nice big box and it actually had all kinds of padding in there protecting the, the whole unit itself and all the accessories so that you're going to get it to your house in perfect condition. It has dual zones. We're going to show you. There's a, a piece of plastic with a sensor on there that we're going to divide the two areas into a fridge and a freezer. It has an overall 20 quart capacity. The door is totally removable we're going to show which is nice and you have a temperature range of 0 to 68 degrees Fahrenheit and I'm showing right here the two zones because I have the divider in already and you can see that the freezer side is 0 degrees and the side is uh, warmer 32 degrees we're going to show you how to change that and how to measure that and where those zones are this has a two-year warranty and the product gets excellent customer ratings it has an eco mode to save you money and uh, regular mode which will have it uh, cool much faster it has various settings so that you could uh, make sure that you have your 12 volt car portion working properly so what's cool about this is that you plug this into your typical cigarette lighter and this plugs into the device you have a nice long cord on here and then we're going to show you this you can power this into your car so you can bring food and keep them frozen or uh, chilled properly it also comes with the power supply that you're going to need and that has a power cord on there that's 120 volts us and a little indicator light on there same uh, lock on there that the 12 volt has because that's essentially providing 12 volts dc to the unit now the manual that it comes with i wouldn't recommend looking at it's a little confusing um, when they took the pictures of the device they mirrored the images so all the descriptions of what is inside is incorrect and it took me a while to figure that I was driving me crazy but then I figured it out so this display has a lock function on there it seems to go to lock mode automatically and they do show you hit the plus and that and it gets out of lock mode there goes the lock mode away so right now it's dual zone so you can see I could change the temperature of the freezer and then you hit the set button and it moves over across to the refrigerator section right there and then that's it you just leave it alone and it'll go back into lock mode lock mode so this little symbol right here is the freezer that little symbol there is the refrigerator now let's take a look inside here at the unit itself i'm going to slide this across on the table and to open this up you pull this back and lift it up and it's got a really nice LED light inside there which is great and uh, you can see it in total darkness here's that divider I was talking about if you pull this divider out it senses it and then it becomes one big 20 uh, liter area that you can put your refrigerator items in this here is an unusual item but you can make ice cubes in the freezer or in your own freezer in your home and put them in here and if you keep this at 32 degrees and this at 32 these ice cubes will stay formed if you want otherwise you can use this as another storage area refrigerator area on there now if I do a temperature gun right here you can see that's about 20 degrees so that's a little cold but you could uh, raise the temperature of the freezer now I'm going to show you right here this right here is working its way down to five degrees and this is almost 40 something now I'm going to take a thermal imaging gun which shows temperatures with a camera and we're going to look right there and if you look on the right where my hand is you can see that's the refrigerator because it's got more green than the left side that is the cool side right there so that is the freezer and that's the fridge and again if you pull this out it will sense that so if I take this out right here this plastic piece you have to have the arrow going up and then you close this before I do that I will show you that there is a latch on the other side 
if you pull that latch out, this comes off for cleaning or easy access. It does not flip. The manual says it flips, that's incorrect, because this only fits one way, like this. Once you put it back on, you pull those out again, and it drops back in place, allowing you to open it up, allowing you to open it up and view what you have inside there. You can also open it up this direction, which is interesting. So it opens up either direction. I think that's what they were trying to say in the manual. So now, if you notice, the display is now a single display and it now reflects. Now it's in the lock mode again, so we're going to hold that to unlock it. And now you can see that it reflects one temperature and I can raise the whole temperature of both those chambers in there and there's where you got your refrigerator on both sides. So as soon as you put this divider in, it senses it and then you're going to have two zones. And this again is the freezer and that is the fridge section. And right now it's one big refrigerator where you could store your drinks or your food. So if you're going camping, fishing, you can even keep fishing here, uh, food from the grocery store, you put this in your car, you power this with the adapter and you're all set. I wanna point out something else is that when the compressor comes on, again, this is a real compressor like in your home fridge, it's very quiet if you listen. So they did a really good job isolating the sound of this and the ventilation system on it is very quiet. So here I have it plugged in on my car. There is a 12 volt right there you could see. And I got an error message because it's only 11.5 volts. And you could change the setting on there, but that's warning me that the car is not on. So now I'm going to turn the car on and we'll be all set. Forgot to mention there was a bottle opener on the right side of the unit, which is really handy. And now I got my car running and there we go. It's on with the freezer temperature and the refrigerator temperature all set. So now I have the ability to use it in my car and have groceries, keep things frozen or cold for shopping in the summertime. This is excellent. And there's USB-A port so that you can charge any device and here I'm charging my Pixel 6 but any USB-A to USB-C cable you could use and charge any device that works with USB-A. After testing, what do I think about the Astro AI brand? Their 12 volt car refrigerator with an actual compressor unit. This is a really nice unit. Just get used to the display. Remember that it always locks and you have to unlock it. And then when you have that divider in there, you got your dual zones on there. I love the capability of this to work in your automobile or your truck or your boat and the ability to work in your house. So if you're going to visit family, bring this thing along and you can bring this to have leftovers in there, uh, Thanksgiving or Christmas. That's what my sister always does. It works out really well for something like that. I love the simplicity of this and the way this cover and comes off for cleaning or opening up on either side or either direction. Very, very nice, large area. Keeps the temperature controls. There's sensors right there on each side that go to the compressor and the electronics and it keeps this thing very accurate. And it's very thick, the insulation. And if you look how thick this is, the R value of this is really high. I love the LEDs on there so you can see a total darkness. Great product. I'm gonna give it a full five star rating. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to alert to new video uploads. And if you thought this review was helpful, please hit the like button. There'll be an ordering link in the information section of this video review. Please use that link when you order this product to help support this channel. I hope this video review helped you with your buying decision. Thank you for watching.